All right, everyone, welcome back. Uh, we're leaving South Carolina and the no see thank God, heading into Georgia. And uh, we are chasing 72, and we finally found it. Yay! <laughs> Big celebration. So uh, we're heading into Crawfordville. This was a controlled burn, but there were trees on fire. And, and we stayed at the A.H. Stevens Park and gotta be honest, just felt really conflicted. This is so beautiful. Look at the site that we're in. It just goes on forever. And the tin goat looked really beautiful in the site. But uh, this is the home of A.H. Stevens, the vice president of the Confederacy, whose cornerstone speech is just so ugly and belies the beauty of this place. So it's a real contradiction. It's it's just such a conflict to be there. Uh, and it was a lot to contemplate. I think even Ollie was kind of contemplating what does this all mean? But at any rate, uh, it was just beautiful. And then on the way out, again, more controlled burn, but there was this tree that was on fire and the whole place was smoky the whole time <laughs> we were there. It was smoky the whole time, but it was kind of nice. Yeah, it was beautiful. So then uh, we went to Marietta. This is Life University. There was a nice little dog park within like a mile of our campground for Ollie. Our campground was nothing to show, believe nothing me. Nothing to write home about, but this was something to write home about. Now we're meeting with James and Meredith in their hometown of Woodstock. Such a gorgeous place. Um, we were at this fantastic barbecue place, little park where there was some music. Um, everything is walking distance. Just such a cute little town. We really enjoyed everything. You can carry your drink around yeah, everywhere. Yeah, <laughs> that was kind of fun. That was a fun little treat. AstroTurf in the dog park. How cool is that? Here, here's my favorite, though. Act natural now. <laughs> oh, James. <laughs> what a goober. <laughs> Love that guy. Uh, and, and, you know, another shot of handsome Ollie. How beautiful is he? And then as we were leaving the park, I saw this. I love this concept, which is exactly what we did when we met with Maddie and Ben. Maddie is my niece. There's Maddie and Ben and a couple of the kids. And we had such a great time. Oh, my gosh. I've been waiting so long to get my hands on them babies. <laughs> oh. They are beautiful babies. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, Cohen really loved oh, Ollie's bed. He's one years old. And... He couldn't wait to get in Ollie's bed. And, and Margot couldn't leave Ollie alone. She, she had her him. hand on him constantly. And Costine wanted to put him in a tutu. How sweet is that? So that he could enjoy the little dance party. And he was so good with them. Look yeah. at Benjamin and Costine yeah. dancing and Ollie's watching. They just loved it. Look at Cohen's cute little tiny feet. Oh, <laughs> gosh. It was so good to see him. So good. It was just great. And finally, they got together on the bed. Yeah, Yay. that was sweet. <laughs> oh, and then we got to see uh, Ben and Maddie's new B&B that they're rebuilding. This is in the North Georgia mountains. So gorgeous. The inside is beautiful. The outside is beautiful. Look at this view. Oh, my gosh. That's going to be such a fun little B&B. &B. Yeah, it was really cool to see it in process. Yeah. And then everyone asked if we got to see the big chicken. Of course we did. And, you know, the big question is... Who wore these glasses better? <laughs> I think we know the answer. And finally, someone with a head bigger than yours. That's right. And James visited us at camp. So great. And then we went out to the Viking Alchemist Meadery, which was fun. We sampled a lot of different meads. These horns are like the local customers have their horns for drinking mead out of. I'm not a local customer, so we just kind of bought right from the bar. And I had to get a little video of all of these sweet gumballs that were all over our campsite. They just fall, fall, fall. They got stuck in Ollie's paws. So we're saying goodbye to Georgia and goodbye to the sweet gum. See you soon.